Ask the Messengers, the program that deals with substance abuse, real people telling real stories. Where there is addiction, there is a chance for recovery. We're trying to help save lives on Ask the Messengers. Today we're going to be talking about cocaine uh, recovery and relapse. Now, we're going to do this a little differently. We're going to be showing you some testimonies of those who are struggling but also some testimonies of those who are recovering because we want you to see uh, that it is it is not unusual uh, that in the walk of life that the people that are closest to us may be struggling with uh, cocaine use uh, and it can start as early as six years old uh, so so ages uh, range from six all the way through adulthood which means uh, some, some of our children, some of our babies are struggling. Some of our adults who are, are housewives, who are, who are, are working jobs, uh, they're struggling with this substance. I w I've been around drugs and the lifestyle all my life, but my first experience with personally smoking crack was at the age of 13. Uh, the first time was 25. I used cocaine. I tried drugs at the age of 19. Now I'm 50 years old now. I was uh, about 30 years old the first time I, I used cocaine. I'm 41 years old. I first started using crack at the age of 35. I think I was about 18. From thir I used cocaine from 30 to 35 before I took a break. And I picked back up about 37 years old. And I quit again about, about 40 at about 40 and I'm 50 years old now. Have I figured out why I started using in the first place? You know, I could sit up here and tell you all kind of garbage. Excuse me, I was about to curse. But I, I could tell you all kind of garbage of what my mama didn't love me and all kinds of garbage, garbage, garbage. But I'm not even going to sit up there and, and do that. You know, it was just my stupid thinking of trying to fit in with people that wasn't, well, mm, just trying to fit in, you know, and that's about it, you know, just my stupidity. I was selling cocaine at the time to uh, a lot of professional people, I would say, uh, models, producers in the industry, and um, they asked for a crack, and I brought it, and uh, I stayed for the entertainment. You know, the models were looking really good, so mm. they was doing crack. And uh, I was just curious. I got too curious, and I took a hit. That was my first experience. I was with some friends I was going to school with, and um, we started hanging around a dude that they were making extra money with. They were making extra money by um, prostituting, selling his drugs, recruiting people. Um, and um, this was around the era when um, people started wearing Adidas and starter jackets and things of that nature. And um, where I was raised to my grandmother and my grandparents weren't big on those things. People were dying for shoes and coats back then. But I still wanted to be like my friends I went to school with. So one day after school, I went with them and started selling drugs in the house and I started using it. In 2014, there were an estimated 1.5 million current cocaine users aged 12 or older in the United States. Ask the messengers.